welcome back friends friends i have completed my work till this level so if i take you to do the demo theme now there are categories are showing under this top fixed navigation bar and this search box so obviously now i will show these categories here as a next work so for this purpose i come back to my code editor and i go to header.php and now i shall make a new page i press ctrl n write some dummy text and now ctrl s and i go inside the includes i would like to tell you show you where i have saved header.php if i come back i would like to show you this is the includes folder which is inside the freelance so if i double click over it header.php so right inside i make this new page on the name of category underscore name dot php category underscore name dot php so now i remove this and now i include this inside the header keep in mind inside the header dot php i am going to include this page right under the closing nav closing nav tab i will show you php make php basic syntax include francis categories category underscore name because this page is inside the include therefore i have included it directly there is no need to put any backslash and folder name because it is inside the include folder and i have included it this is the closing nav tag and this is it is starting and container div is inside it so outside of this nav tag i have included this one so now i control s to save i start my work here category underscore nav that php page i make a div div start and div close and i assign it a class mp dash box mb dash box dash white no top d space lg dash block i will explain anything but first you let me write d dash none so friend now i would like to explain you this one mp dash box is my custom class you can assign it any name and this one also mp dash box dash white because i have given it is it this name because this name suits me is color will be white if i take you here and you can see the background color will be white therefore i have assigned this name you can give any name and this no top is also because it is not a top but this is d dash lg dash block is the default class of bootstrap 4 actually this class works to show the categories on a big screen and d dash none is also the bootstrap 4 class and this class works to hide the categories on smaller screens i would like to show you i go back to my browser now i take you to the demo theme now you can see that all these categories are showing because this is a big screen but if i decrease it is size it is size now you you will not see those categories here even i click here those categories those categories are not showing here if I increase the size of this browser screen slowly, so now you can see that it has begun to show. With the passage of big screen, when I increase the size, then these categories are showing. Now it, it has been hidden. So these categories will only be shown when it is size will be bigger on larger screen. On smaller screen, these categories will not be shown. So this is the meaning of this class d dash lg dash block and d dash none. When you hide it, hide them on smaller screen. So now I write the comment. I copy this and I paste it here. I copy this comment and paste it at the closing div. 
ends. Now I make one more div inside this div. And assign it a class box dash row. Box dash row starts. When you show the box in a row style. Ends. Now you make a UL. UL start and UL close. And assign a class to this UL. Main dash cat dash list. Active. It will be active. And this is also my made custom class, not the bootstrap class, main dash cat dash list. My main category list should be active. Now I make the ally. Ally start and ends. Now I make the anchor tag inside this ally for showing the link ahar of HTTP localhost freelance backslash category dot php and this is the get variable I have made this get variable by putting this add cat underscore id so this cat get variable will be called in php later on actually here is the two slash not the three backslashes i i have not just uh, started the php work but i have given this link therefore i have added this get variable otherwise i have not made it when i will start the php work then this get variable will be made and then too I will explain it but you keep in mind that this get variable will be used in PHP work I have just now given it here here I write graphic design Now I make one more div under this anchor tag. Div start and div close. And assign it a class. Menu dash count mean content. It is also my made custom class. Menu contents. Menu dash content starts mean count starts and ends. You can assign any name whatever you suits. Now I make a UL inside this div for showing the subcategories which will be inside the graphic designing category and I make the ally when drop down subcategories will be shown in drop down cat menu obviously graphic designing will be the main category headline so I have made one anchor tag inside this and I write this URL address child id i would like to show you that this url the same url category.php page this page has not created yet it will be also made and second this second get variable it is the this it is child because if i take you to my browser and this is the demo theme if i take my browser over graphic designing cursor then you can see that all these subcategories are showing so these subcategories are showing due to given this cat child id because it will be obviously the child id of this cat id it will every 
every main category like this one graphic designing digital marketing everyone is bringing it his own specific id and all the categories which are inside this category are the top one child ids so these get variables and this page will be made later on category.php and these category ids will be called later on in php here i write logo design and i have duplicated it because it is the static work so there is no need to assign them the different names i'm just showing if i have duplicated them now i'm going to copy this complete ul this complete ul and i press enter and i have pasted so friend i have pasted this ul right under it is closing ul so i now i press control s to save and if I come here to this is the theme which is being made, I refresh this page. It is refreshing. So now you can see that these categories are showing in this way. And this top web designing is not showing because I have not stylized them in style the CSS. So it does not matter. So now it is showing in this way. I come back and now I shall copy this ally. This complete ally the ally which is closing here and this is it is closing point i show you it is starting point this is it is starting point keep in mind that ally start therefore i have commented it ally start and here ally end so i shall copy this complete ally and paste it four and five times more keep in mind four and five times more so i copy it this one I press here one time, two time, three time, four time, fifth time. Control S to save. So now I come here and I refresh this page. So now you can see that all these categories are showing in this way. So friend, this work has been completed till this level. I shall come back in next video to do the more work over these categories.